Let's take a moment and close your eyes and open your heart and be, remember yourself as the light of the Holy Spirit. And John Roger said one way to think of light is L-I-G-H-T, living in God's holy thoughts. And just meditate on that for a moment, living in God's holy thoughts. And the beauty and the opportunity of this level is that it, while it may seem when we are in that denser forgetting that it is restrictive, it is actually a springboard for multidimensionality. As we awaken, as we are born into love each time we choose to love when all circumstance would press upon us to choose less than love. That is the Christ being reborn within us. And so become aware of your body, that part that is seemingly in forgetfulness, seemingly in individuality, seemingly separate from the allness. And just recalling that while it's a compelling illusion that you are solid, that the body is solid and dense, recall Christ, that the body is mostly essence, mostly the space between matter, water, flowing, energy. And so see your body and see it as it is, which is mostly light, mostly fluid, and just see that light of the Christ in essence, breaking apart the body, allowing the body to float apart, to expand. And that space just becomes bigger in the body so that you are in the individuality and in the awareness that you are all at the same time and your body fills the room because the light has expanded it so much and see that light breaking up any karmic accretions, any density, any pain, any dis-ease, any chronic illness in the body, it just starts to disperse. And it's not that it's going anywhere, it's that you are seeing it for what it is, which is just opportunity, experience. Your only job, as you recall, is to experience for God as God. And so the body keeps expanding and the light goes through all any ectoplasmic aura within you, as you, and it fills the space and it starts even breaking up the walls of the space that you're in and the body expands through the city that you're in and that you see that light again obfuscating any blocks any places in forgetfulness of their divine nature. And you're aware that you're individual and disindividual and disintegrated consciousness at the same time. Undifferentiated consciousness and differentiated. And the mind cannot hold that, and so you let go of the mind. As the body expands, now the light goes through your mind and you see your mind starting to expand into the light of the Christ, into the mind of God. And you see that light, again, just going into any areas that have held you in your story of individuation. That light goes in any areas of trauma, any images of limitation. That light, it's like an eraser. And it goes in and it shines brilliant. And it remembers any reoccurring thoughts, any perseveration, any 
thought forms. They just have to break away and expand into this light like confetti. And your mind expands. Again, you are living in God's holy thoughts. And your mind gives way into the Christ, into the allness. And you are aware of being many disparate parts of the mind and you are each of that and you are aware that you are a million individuals and not a million individuals, that you are the allness. Again, the mind cannot hold that, so you let go and ride upon the wind of the Holy Spirit. And you are the shimmer in the mind of the Christ. And that light goes all through your emotions again, any reoccurring emotion. And the twinkling of an eye now is dispersed into the Christ. And so your emotions expand into devotion, consecration, liberation. Yes, you can. Yes, you are. And that light now disperses even the soul into the soul of the Christ, into the soul of God. As you hang out in that loving of who you are through all your lifetimes and all your learnings, all the learnings of God, you're aware that you are all that God has learned as the soul, as your soul. And you travel even further beyond the soul, transcending the soul. Traveling on as the Christ. Aware of the story of you as a whisper and that story of you lets go. And you are everywhere as love's story. And you are everywhere as the story of the Christ, as the learnings of God as the Christ. And you are everywhere as the whole spirit. A million trillion flickering lights and the allness living in God's holy thoughts. Amen. Amen.